Hey, what's up, everybody? Adobe Masters here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to create proper cinematic black and white footage. So that's what we're going to be doing today. First off, import your footage. This is a piece of footage from my course. Check out a link in the description below to check out that course and learn Premiere Pro. So once you import in the footage, what you want to do is use Lumetri to get your black and white. There is an effect called black and white under video effects, image control, and black and white. You can drop that in, you can quickly get a black and white, but it's gonna come out dull and you're not going to have the ability to manipulate it how you want. So instead, what I would suggest is to go to Lumetri, which is an effect that you can drag either from here or you can just open up, uh, you gotta search color, uh, right here under video effects color correction. You can drag it on and then use it in the effect controls or just use the Lumetri color panel. What you wanna do is you wanna take the saturation, bring it all the way down, and you see that pretty much recreates that black and white effect we had. But now we need to make it pop. All we have is black and white, so if we just have a, a really small gambit of dull colors, it's not gonna be fun. So we're gonna take the blacks and we're gonna bring them down just a little bit, make, these, make there be actual true black in some part of this black and white. We wanna take the highlights and we wanna bring them up a little bit. We're doing the exact same thing. We're trying to make there be actual white in some parts of this. Bring the contrast up a touch, and then the exposure up just a little bit. Because when you're in black and white, you've lost a little bit of that color that gives you that vibrancy and pop. So you need just a little extra boost. And then now let's take a look at that right there. And this is looking very nice and crisp. We can take a quick look by if I go to the black and white and just drag that back on. We can see the difference here. And it is pretty large. So see, this one is decent, but the colors are a little bit on the dull side. If you see that once we bring this one out, they look, like I said, poppy and strong. While this one, it's still black and white, but just like notice her hair and the building right here. It's a completely different feel and vibe to it. So that is a quick way to create cinematic black and white. It just use Lumetri color, drop that saturation, drop the blacks, raise the highlights, raise the contrast, raise the exposure a little bit, manipulate them around there, and you'll get a really nice looking black and white piece of footage. Thanks everyone for joining me. If you have any questions or comments, go ahead and throw them in the comment section below or on our website at adobemasters.net. If you would like to learn Premiere Pro, then check out the link in the description below. It is a course that I made with tutorial-based learning, meaning that on every single class or lecture in that course, you're going to be learning a skill and then each skill will build off of the next skill and they'll continually get stronger and stronger with more and more complexity. And by the end of it, you'll be a Premiere Pro master. So check that out. Thanks everyone. Until next time, see ya.